Well, if you were in the Cass and Manorville area today, you may have noticed a few kids out and about <laughs> around town, and maybe you were wondering, hey, why aren't they in school? That's right. ABC 6 News reporter Megan Rice had found out what they were up to. Jared Blaine and his friends have had a busy morning at Oxbow Park and Zulman Zoo. Uh, probably about a half an hour, hour. They're helping out for the Cass and Manderville Community Service Day. Middle school students doing more than 30 service projects. Since I got the longest arms over here, they rake up, <laughs> up small piles and I pick them up and bring them over here. And without their help, they probably would not get done. Traveled just a little more than 10 miles to Cassin. And she won again. Students are visiting with residents at Prairie Meadows Senior Living. Oh, she can play Ethan Mark over and up. Well, it's fun. I wasn't so sure about it in the first place. They had to kind of drag me down here. <laughs> and this is a day giving for us. And I think what we want to be able to do is produce kids that are kids of character, kids that care about others and can find opportunity to give back to their community. And I think as a school, we know the importance of providing for our kids for all of their needs and this is one way that we reach the whole child on a typical day we'd be in science we'd be in science right now but Tuesday kids took time out of the classroom to learn what can't be taught in textbooks we gotta learn how to help the community and stuff like that Megan Rice dead ABC 6 News how fun well the whole school participated in the fifth annual community service day that's more than 700 students good lessons today yeah, it's a lot of community service i think more schools should do that more often yeah great idea mm -hmm.